Hey everybody, it is I, Sakamoto, here with another episode of Undertale. Uh, I'm in the middle of a battle, but I'm in the same place as I was, because I didn't start recording yet. I'm sorry about that. This is Ice Cap. Uh, make sure his hat is still there. Yeah, he's obsessed with his hat. I'm going to compliment his hat. Okay, whatever. Mr. Sassy. Duh, who doesn't know that? Okay. I also want to have his nose. Ignore him this time. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. What? What are you doing? Fuck you. That's what I'm doing. I mean, wait, that didn't sound right. <laughs> um, how about we steal it? You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. Oh, crap. I don't want to hit him. I thought you could go through fights without attacking. Okay. Guess we'll try sparing him again. Uh. This teen wonders why it's named Ice Hat. No, no. It's not made of snow as long as it's going to there. I looked at your hat. Oh my god. Some of these boss fights are really, the boss fights. Monster fights can be really annoying. I don't want to hurt him. Hey, I got away. Look at that. See, he told you I was in the same place. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Oh, and I got my controller to work on the game, so... That's cool. We're playing with the controller now. It's a fishing rod fixed to the ground. Reel it in. Also attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. Okay. Now we're going this way. So, as I was saying about Undyne... Exclamation point. <laughs> that was crazy. Sans! Oh my god, is that a human? And it looks so familiar. Uh, I think it looks familiar. Because it's a rock? Oh! Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! I'm dying, Will. I'm gonna. I'll be so popular, popular, popular! Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I'll then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. And then, then. I, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue. Only if you dare. <laughs> well, that will go. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Thanks. Oh, almost as annoying as Ice Cap, it got more annoying. Pickle, you blew the snow jig. This won't be funny either. <laughs> snow Jake is smiling at his own bad joke. You laugh at Snow Jake first of anything funny. Oh no, he didn't say a joke yet, apparently. Ah! Snow Jake is practicing his next one. Joke. You make a bad ice pun. <laughs> nice try. This is actually easier with the joystick. Snowdrake is practicing its next one. Come on! <laughs> Maybe that'll work. Huh. Ah! Smells like a wet pillow. <sighs> you do this with an insult to our humans.
I'm just gonna randomize it. It's supposed to be funny. No. There we go, that'll work. Hopefully. Ow. Hmm, please let me win. Yay. Finally. Now I gotta go back to the save point and hope I don't run into anything else stupid. Why is I got money? Oh, I'm gonna run into somebody else, aren't I? Look at how far back I have to go. I wish I had some kind of repellent like Pokemon. Oh, you again. Ice puns are no problem. Okay, I gotta wait for him to basically have a pun in his, what he says as a quote, basically. Okay, like it, the pun will be in quotes and then that'll let you know that you can hit laugh and then go away. I kind of want to try to hit, do an ice, ice cap again. Okay. So you immediately go to spare, and then go to laugh. That's all you gotta do, apparently. At least as far as what I've been able to tell from the last fight. And this one, you have good taste in jokes. Hey, what does that mean? Ow. Alright, no more, no more fights. Let's wait. I don't want to check this out. There's some narration on this cover box. You observed the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you Honda? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, it's not yet the very famous royal guardsman. Okay, Papyrus. Absolutely no moving. I... Oh boy. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. Pet. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Okay. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Will it move this time? Doggo can't seem to find anything. <laughs> How recent for the squirrels. We'll move this time? Do I like need to move? You pet doggo. What? I've been pet? Huh? Pet? Pet? Pop? Pet? Pop? Pop? Pet? <laughs> Yay, 30 gold. Something. Some. How do I do dog again? Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. <laughs> Actually, I was more like, I'm gonna need some dog treats for this, because he's like, sneaky, kind of, druggy guy, whatever. Because he's, look, someone's been smoking dog treats, see what I mean? Alright, Sans, what do you got for me? Hey, there's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Thanks, buddy. Oh, great. This happens in Pokemon, too. At least the first one. I don't, know. I don't think I played anything really hardly past, uh... Game Boy Advance gens yet, um, but I could, because I have the means, North Ice, South Ice, West Ice, East Snowden Town, and Ice. Okay, thank you. I kind of want to see if it's anything else. Remember, blue stop signs. Unless our dog appears. Okay, we got check, pet, 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 pet. You barely left to do hand unless your dog got excited. Okay, pet. Out. Come on, buddy. This dog is barking inside. Now we could spare him, or we could keep petting him and see what happens. You lightly touch the dog. It's already overexcited. Oh, what the heck? 
How do I get... You got the dog. It raises its head up to meet your hand. I can't. Okay. That's your dog is barking excitedly. With the dog. It was a good dog. Excited noises. Oh, come on. You need some... Bandage. There we go. Ah, that's how you get past that. Okay. Because your dog is overstimulated. You pet the dog, it's excitement, knows no bounds. Excited noises. I go right here, and then go this way. That won't hit me either. Good. You figured out the patterns, boys. Critical pet. Dog excitement increased. Excited noises. Let her dog. That's her dog is overstimulated. You have to jump up to pet the dog. Motor revving. That's her dog is overstimulated. You don't even pet it, it gets more excited. Plane take off. So dog shows, okay. Shows no signs of stopping. There is no way to stop this madness. Kettle whistle. That's her dog shows no signs of stopping. That's her dog enters the realm of the clouds. Dot dot dot. That's her dog, okay. You call the dog, but it is too late. I cannot hear you. Far away bark. That's her Dot, dot, dot. Dot, dot, dot. You can reach Lesser Dog again. Bark. Pant, pant. He's lowering now. It's possible that you may have a problem. <laughs> I can't read his words anymore. I don't have a problem. Come on now. This is fun. Isn't this fun? I'm just, we're just having a time, aren't we? We're just having a great... Oh boy. Come on, say some other stuff. Maybe if I try one of the different pet commands. No. Good thing we don't we didn't hit him, his defense is only two. I just wanna see how far we can get the dog's neck to go and stretch. He's learning to read. That's beautiful, it must be because his head's down here now. Unless her dog is un uh, unpetable but, but appreciates the attempt. <laughs> That's your dog is whining because he can't see you. Oh. Toriel, this place isn't dangerous. This is fun. I can see his head on the bottom. It's starting to come up on the other side. Hello there. <laughs> Perhaps mankind was not meant to pet to pet this much. <laughs> Hello there. Interesting. It continues. Hello there. It continues. Mr. Dog is questioning your choices. 
Imagine programming this. Imagine how much time was spent on just this one battle. Way more than I'm spending on it, that's for sure. If any of y'all are still here and haven't skipped ahead to pass this fight, I don't blame you. I, I'm, I'm proud of you for sticking with it. And if you ha aren't here anymore, then I definitely don't blame you. <laughs> um, this is just, I just want us all to experience the absolute silliness of this battle here. Quote unquote battle. We're, we're actually just petting a dog with, in armor and standing up who stretches his neck out to some ridiculous ridiculousness. Unless your dog has gone where no dog has gone before. Oh, whoops, wrong dog is beyond your reach. Is the dog is gone where no dog is gone. Okay. Really? <laughs> Sounds like the creator of the game is just mad now. He's just like, really? <laughs> Come on, this is fun. We're having fun here. Isn't this fun, guys? Oh my gosh. I just want to see if his head, like... Comes back up one more time, and then we'll stop, okay? Alright, I'll give it a few more tries. And then we'll stop. Alright, 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 right. that's enough. That's enough! <laughs> 60 gold, pretty good. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. You'd be so kind, traveler. Please, take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. The thing is, once we leave here, the Snowden town and the area around it, we're not going to be able to, uh... Yeah, I think the snowman piece melts or something later in the game. Anyways. Right. Really though, that human. Do I know that person? Do you not know who you know? <laughs> of course I know who I know. I wanted to know if you know. I know who I know as much as I know who I know. No? Oh ho, speak of the devil. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one. Why it's shocking! For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze! When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap! Sound like fun? Sound like fun? <laughs> because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. <laughs> Sands! What did you do? Uh, I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. So, he basically just gave it to us. Okay, try now. Uh, I kind of want to see... Okay, well, that didn't really do anything. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be so easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that word outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, is my brother cool? <laughs> I don't understand why these aren't selling. 
It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello. Oh, wow, we have a lot of money right now. Would you like some ice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Here you go. That was a super duper day. You got the ice cream. HP. Instead of a joke, the rapper says something nice. Hmm. Give me another nice cream. Bitch. Just kidding. <laughs> Thanks for the ice cream, buddy. Oh, it's a ball. Kick around inside of this thing. Hey, Sans, what's up, buddy? Oh, you've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Fine. Did I say five? I meant fifty. Really? How about five thousand? Five, fifty thousand gold. That's my friend offer. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. <laughs> I've been thinking about something. You're right. I should charge way more than that. <laughs> Great. I ain't gonna try a whistle right now, it's right now. Whistling is not something I do very often. It's kinda of difficult for me with the way my mouth is, so. Oh, now you want me to do it, okay. Holy shit, we did it. Rad. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. Okay. There's a camera hidden inside this lump of snow. What's with all the freaking cameras everywhere? That's cool. Reminds me of Land Stalker. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman. Snowman. White rating can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. Okay. Uh, I'm hiding. Human, I hope you're ready for... Sense, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Monster kids, word search. Ice E. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? I just have to... You just have to walk past it. You don't have to try and figure this out. We got cigars in there. And... Gas... Fickle... Febreber... And skeletons, hot robot, mermaid, sig. Um, okay, I guess monster kids are a little bit more mature than adult ki uh, human kids. They probably wouldn't have words like sigs and cigars and giavflik olfebreber, which is very inappropriate. Sense, that didn't do anything. Whoops, I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hottest. What? Really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Um, crossword. You two are weird. Oh, shit. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I meant to pick the one he wanted. I just fill all the bo boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yeah! Papyrus finds difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday you got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> Yay, shame point! <laughs> Knowing, the mouse might Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. 
It'll be, you know, the spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. It'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you are progress you are progressing. Thoroughly taped again by the great papyrus. Yeah, papyrus. It's an unplugged microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> it's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold it's stuck to the table. Okay, we can, have, we can fit one more item, I think, in our item thingy. Warning, dog marriage. Ooh. That was cool. I was checking that out, you guys. Okay, Ice Gap appears, and Jerry came too. Let's see about Jerry. No, we don't want to ditch Jerry. Try scratch. I'm thinking, guys. Snow? No, it's hat. Residue. Cherry tells everyone it has to go to the bathroom. I think we can only ditch Jerry. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. I just love my hat, okay? The other monsters celebrate Jerry's disappearance. I want to figure out what to do with Ice Cap. Try it. Oh, you know, I think... I think you have to, like, pick those three in a very specific order. That's what you have to do. Oh, look, Jerry's still there. Ow. Oh. It's okay, we got lots of health bars. Return of Jerry. Guys, I'm gonna do what I don't want to do and see if this works. Okay. Why are we doing this? You fail. Oh. Okay, well, I'm not gonna hit him again. I knew it. Thief. Okay. I guess you just ignore him a lot? Yay, we did it. Now I can go back to this button stuff that feels like you got bubble wrap almost and you're popping it. Very satisfying. Heal myself. Okay, Frisk. Where are we gonna go now, buddy? Not that way, apparently. <sighs> okay, next thing, since he said a snow pun, I'm gonna laugh at his pun. No. No, Drake. You guys suck at this. What a great hat, mine. I'm gonna try only ignoring his hat like three times, and then maybe that'll work.
Hello? My hat's up here. I'm glad Jerry doesn't have any packs, so it really doesn't matter if he's there or not. Uh, okay, we just headed north twice. I wish I didn't know that before, instead of kind of all those different things. They both this you. Cool. Uh... Okay, there's a switch in it's not quick. Okay. We're gonna have to have another battle probably, aren't we? Maybe not. Okay, here's the dogs that are coming up. <sighs> What's that smell? Where's that smell? Pure smell? Identify your smell. Hmm, here's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! Dog I assault you. Dog Amy and Dog Arissa. Uh, roll around. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Don't touch my hot dog. He means me. <laughs> uh, shit. No! Dogs may want to re-smell you. Re-sniff. Dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell right. What? Smells like a... You're actually a little puppy? Shit falls in the cock and the barrel. Alright, we're good. Dogs think that you may be a lost puppy. So all you have to do now is pet them. You pet dog Amy. Wow, pet by another pup. Oh, don't leave me out. Ow. Dogs think that you may be a lost puppy. Uh, give me the spider gun. Don't worry, spider didn't. <laughs> Take my wife, please. Don't actually. Oh, okay. All right, let's try petting the other one. Let's pet the dog rest up. Oh, come on, the dog pets dog for me. Yay. Dogs can pet other dogs? The new world is open up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Okay. Turn every X into a zero, then press the switch. You got it. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Hate it. Really? Wowee! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Tsundere. Human! Hmm. How do I say this? You are taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle. By arriving, by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. I got this. I'll come in from up here. Uh, nope. That's not gonna work. Hmm. I know what to do. Okay. Nope, that's not gonna work either. I have to make it so we exit out without... Hang on a second. Uh, 
There are three sides we can come in from. I got it. Wow, you solved it, and you did it all without my help. Incredible, I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see over there, buddy. Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love ups doing absolutely nothing. Me too. <laughs> hey, it's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Some do if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soul smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How's that? Understand? You understand the explanation? No. But I'm gonna say yes, I did, because I'm not listening to that again. Great! There's only one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Yeah, get ready. <laughs> womp womp womp. Womp womp womp. Actually, that's the good from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll be... He'll even... He'll even make something edible. I'm seeing him working. Yeah, this is why I kept messing with the dog, because then you get this. If you just... Do the dog really quickie... Quick... Quickie... <laughs> <laughs> quickly, you don't get any of this fun stuff all over the place. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination. Aware of dog, please pet dog. On the floor inside is a box of Pomeranians. Pomeranians. Not Pomeranians? Pomeranians? Okay. I thought it was Pomeranian. It's the broken head of a snow dog. Uh, Like the base of a snow dog. Okay. Dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it's rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. Beautiful. I had two pointless conversations. I need to save again. Alright guys, now we gotta do this. Or do we? Yeah, we do. It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sands written on it in red marker. Great. Okay, let's try going this way first. And I fucked up. Oh yeah. Hey, it worked. We'll take it. Yay. <laughs> I have a snow hat. That's cute. That's cute. It's a snow paw. And this is a snow paw. This, however, oh, is a snow paw. Surprisingly, it's a snow paw. Snow paw. Is it really a snow paw? 
Oh, the soap off. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? Did I actually get that? Oh no, there's a dog here. I wasn't done doing other stuff, Mr. Doggo. Oh boy. It's the greater dog. Okay, this one you do have to... You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flicking slobber into your face. The greater dog is seeking affection. The pet the greater dog curls up in your lap as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Mm -hmm. And it wakes up! It's so excited! Uh, you make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splashes on the ground. The other dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. The rest is head on you. Pet capacity is 4%, 40%. Your pet decides to leave. Pet, ca pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Okay, does that mean we can spare him now? Go back to the other stuff we were doing? Yay. Thanks for the 40 gold, Mr. Doggo. Uh, eh, his butt's sticking out of the head of the armor. What's this called? It must be bigger on the inside. Oof. Okay, now we're gonna go down here. Check this place out. Okay, we got eyeballs staring at us. That's cool. Gift truck. Undecorate. Remove a stocking full of chicken nuggets. That's a little better. Oh no. Slightly less irritated. Are those claws natural? <laughs> I don't know which one it was. Oh, it doesn't matter. A small confused dog. Okay. Bald at that time. Um, the lenticular bookmark of a smug teen weekend. Wait, this one looks good. Give Trump's problems. I've been taking away about 20 gold. Yay. What is this music? door. I can't go through it? At oh, least not right now. Well, this place has interesting music, that's for sure. I'm curious about this, though. Oh, well. Well, let me know in the comments, whenever anyone does finally watch any of this, um, what the frick I was I supposed to do there? What was that about? I don't know, but we gotta keep going for the adventure awaits. Or, we're in the adventure, that was part of the adventure. You know, just go on with all these different perceptions about what we're doing, but you know, we're just gonna stop rambling and just... Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Oh god, what is that? 
When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each path will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Whoa, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm about to activate it now. But uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, may be too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Away it goes. Ew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nyeh. Heh. Heh. Seem dead as fuck. I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. Why were you? I would make sure I understand your attacks. I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understood your attacks. Okay, that's better. That's the delivery. Wait, listen to the song. Alright guys, um, so that's gonna end this episode, we just got to Snowden Town, oh, sorry lady, I'll talk to you when I get back, that's another cool little song, but, uh, obviously, welcome to Snowden Town, um, let's see if I can enter the plan, I wanna keep playing, but, feels like we should enter, exit, exit, stop, this, Episode here. Wow, I have a lot of money for the beginning of a game. Okay. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, everybody. Um, thanks for watching this episode of Sakamoto plays Undertale with me, Sakamoto, and I will see you in the next one. This will be part three of Undertale. Enjoy the rest of your day, or stick around and watch more, I don't know, up to you, whatever you want to do. I love you guys either way. Alright, have a great...